Okay, it's quite dark now. It's um, it's around about half past eight in the evening. I'm back in Nottingham. I was in Brighton for a few days and I'm back now in Nottingham. Um, it's impossible to work on the car in Brighton. I do work on it quite a lot here in Nottingham. Um, I keep all of my tools here. In fact, we're under a we're under a street light, you know, but um, it's not actually doing me any good. And I do have, thankfully, I have an LED. There we go. That's better. Um, I've got an LED directly above the camera. What I, I have a problem with the, in fact, when I bought the car, the windscreen washer didn't work. This is the little motor for the windscreen washer. I've checked out the fuses. The fuses seem to be fine. I don't know if the motor's burnt out, whether we have a, a crack or a split in the wires, or maybe there's an earth problem. I don't know. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to, um, I'm going to set the um, the multimeter to around about 20 volts and I'm going to test, see if we've got any current running to these two wires leading to the pump. Um, what I'm hoping to see, I'm hoping to see around about 12 volts, possibly more, as much as 12.2, 12.3 volts running to these two wires here. So let me just try and, um, where can I put the camera? Um, I'm struggling a bit because the... Um, the 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 microphone I, I normally wear a lapel microphone but the actual jack that goes into the camera well actually i say camera this is a smartphone and um, it goes into the bottom of the smartphone it's knackered and um, we've got no um, we've got no lapel mic whatsoever i'm afraid so let's just zoom out does that zoom out no it doesn't okay never mind um, we'll 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 figure this out so what i need to do is I've just put the camera, I've just sort of dropped the camera. I normally I rely on a, um, a, 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 a tripod, but um, without wearing a lapel mic, you can't hear what I'm saying. It's a bit of a nightmare. So if I just pull off, let me just pull off the terminals. Here we go. And in my pocket, I've got a couple of tiny little um, crocodile clamps. So if I just push the crocodile clamps straight onto the um, electrical terminals, then what I should be able to do is trap trap the um, the terminals for the um, in fact let's just set the meter at uh, 20 20 volts um, we're hoping to see no more than 12.3 12.5 so 20 will be fine right what I'm gonna do um, I've, I've put the crocodile clips on I'm just going to I'm just gonna throw oh, you yeah. that's it here we go I'm just gonna trap it in the crocodile clip this is the this is the opposite terminal for the um, for the multimeter it's a bit bloody awkward at night in the dark but um we'll get there forgive me here we go there we go that's one on where's the other there it is so um and what i'm going to do i'm going to sort of set the uh set the multimeter to read now i will need to be able to see this multimeter i'm going i'm going to go inside the car and i'm going to turn on the ignition and I'm going to press the um, I'm going to press the uh, the button for the uh, now. Then we need to be able to see. I need that propped up a little bit. Let's have a look. I tell you what. Let's borrow this little cap here, the the pressure cap. The uh, yeah, let's see now. If we stick that in the corner here, we should be able to prop. Can we prop it up? Yes, you devil. Come on, stand up. That's it. So we'll be able to go round, you and I are going to go round, we're going to go around the front of the car, turn on the ignition, and hopefully, hopefully, can we read that? Let me just zoom this in. There we go, I'm on the other side of the car, obviously. Let's just go inside. I'm going to turn on the ignition and press the, uh, here we go, let's turn on the ignition. I just need to press this, press the, uh, the switch. Is the ignition fully on? Yes, it is. What have we got there? Let's just zoom right in. And I'm just pressing the button now. There we go. Ah, 12.23, but that reads as a minus. Minus 12.23, that's not what I was expecting. Let me just um, return that to zero by taking my thumb off the button. That minus should disappear. Yes, yes, is it flashing? Yeah, the minus has disappeared. Oh no, it's back again. No, it's yeah, it's disappeared. So if I push my thumb back on the button, we've got 12.1, yeah, we've got 12 volts. That's coming straight from the battery. It's not coming from the alternator. But I'm a bit worried about that minus signal before. Um, I'll need to do a little bit of investigation. Uh, let's just turn the ignition off. 
zoom out you can see what I'm doing here so yeah the the, the button here for the um, for the pump it's there but there's nothing happening absolutely nothing at all so um, we had a minus a minus 12 volt reading which was unusual I was expecting to see I was really rather hoping to see 12 12 volts 12.2 12.3 volts but it read minus so I need to do a little bit of investigation is that um, is that an earth leak um, it could be an earth problem um, I'm not sure I'm really not sure I need to do a little bit of investigation so let me just pop these um, take these silly little crocodile clips off uh, I know it's not working but I'm going to put the wires back exactly as I found them here's the um, here's the pump oh god if it's if, if it turns out to be a broken pump it's not the end of the world these pumps are about um, 16 pounds brand new I'm not really worried about that but um, you never know ah there isn't a cap on here but I'll probably need to buy the whole plastic bottle with a cap on it as well um, but yeah something yeah you know, I've got no I've got no windscreen wash or whatever so um, I'm really not sure about that um, it's been a very very long day I've done a 15 16 hour day and now I'm trying to fiddle with the car um, I'm not sure um, I'm really not sure whether that red that there's a problem with the um, with the motor or whether actually the current is going to earth I will need to do a bit more investigation